All right, so today we're going to show you how to completely reset your progress in Last Epoch while using Steam Cloud. So if you want to completely erase all of your characters, your stash, everything, and still use the Steam Cloud without without it overriding whatever you delete, right? So you go to the Manage uh, small icon here, you go to Properties, you disable Steam Cloud first, go to Local Files, go to Browse. This will this will get you into your um, your last epoch folder. So in here you click on Steam, you go to User Data, click on your User Data number. Last epoch is eight nine nine seven seven zero. So you delete whatever is in this folder. And then you also want to delete your save files. So your save files are stored in local disk, user, uh, whatever your username is, app data, local low, 11th hour games, last epoch, and then there's a saves folder. You delete everything that's in here. And I also have a save shortcut folder. I don't know why, sometimes there's some stuff in here. So you can delete whatever is in here as well if you have this. Once that is done, you want you want to uh, reopen like get back into Steam, go to last epoch and open the game so that you create a new character and you can now create a new save file. So we're gonna do this right now. I will create a sorcerer. We can name it whatever YouTube one. Create character. Once you are in the game, you want to exit game. You want to close Steam completely. And then you want to reopen Steam. Once that is done, um, you go back to last epoch. You go back to manage properties. You go to re-enable the Steam Cloud, click X here, and you open up the game. You should have a window pop up that will uh, tell you that you basically have a conflict between your your local files and your cloud save. You want to click on uh, upload your local files to the cloud. It should pop. It should probably pop another window which will tell you that they, they were not able to like back up your uh, your your game files. So you, you still press play anyways, and you will now have your new save files in your in the game. So we see here I have my mage, YouTube one, and this is my new character. So now you are all set. That's it for today, guys, and thank you so much for watching.